Hey folks, and today we have a uh, headphone review. Actually, this is just an unboxing of the JVC HASR185B headphones. I got these for $25 at Meyer. If it would obtain focus, it's not going to. But anyway, yeah. On the front here, we got just a bunch of brag sheet. Works up with iPhone. On this side, we have a little bit better look at the headphones. On the back, it has another brag sheet. And it does have a microphone, too. I didn't actually notice. There was a Sony set for, like, $5 less that didn't include a microphone. And, uh, these are foldable, as you can probably see. So let's go ahead and open this baby. Let me go ahead and find my, uh, unboxing knife. Sometimes you gotta use what you got to uh, unbox some stuff. Yes, I gotta do this off camera. I hope I don't ruin the box, because I might be returning these if they don't sound good. So I'm gonna be returning them if they don't sound good. Because that's the way I am. I ain't going to keep a piece of technology that doesn't work right. I've done that before, and I've regretted it. Plus, these are just headphones, so I can always find more. Okay, we got uh, part one of two here. Let me get part two here. Or at least attempt. I'm trying not to ruin the box, so that way I can return it if uh, it doesn't sound good, or if it's uh, poorly built or something. Gotta love these type of unboxing experiences. It's almost like they don't want you in the package. If you want to know the truth. Okay. We got, uh, ah, there we go. And I just, uh, put a nice boo-boo in the box. I hope that ain't bad, because if they don't let me return it because of that, I'm going to be quite mad. But uh, I will be keeping these if they do sound good. So let's go ahead and open the box here. Everybody's moment of truth. And I will at least attempt to move the tripod a little bit. And then, uh, ah, there we go. Got plastic. Crap. And here are the headphones. I've been waiting all day to open these. But anyway, there's the headphones. There's your uh, gold-plated jack. And uh, yeah, let's go ahead and take these babies out of its wrapping. They do look quite good, though. For $25 headphones, they do look good. I think, they're, I think they could be up there with my uh, Vivitar ones I paid $5 for. But anyway, as for the headband, look at that. They couldn't even put cushioning up there. So, uh, I hope, uh, I hope, uh, it will cushion, or I hope it will still feel good, despite ha not having that cushion, but it at least does have, uh, some cushioning around the ear cups. And when I put them on, I can barely hear myself. So... Yeah. And there's the cable. It's gold-plated. Let me go ahead and uh, unravel this. And yes, this is made in China. For the 2% of you that really care. Zip ties. And, it, and there's the microphone right there. Nice little clicky button. Unfortunately, I can't, like, demo this uh, pair of headphones, like on the microphone of this uh, particular camera so let me go ahead and test them and I will come back with results okay folks I'm done testing them finally let me clean off my lens a little bit but anyway I'm done testing them and here's the verdict they sound well I'm not going to say they sound amazing because that would be an overstatement about these headphones these uh, little bass ports do help with the audio at least I will give it that uh, yeah, 
these do sound okay. I'm not going to say that they sound awesome, but maybe I'm just used to a lot of bass in my music. I don't know what it is, but uh, these aren't as bassy as I expected them to be. They're actually, like, you can't really feel it, but at least it's there. It's there, but uh, yeah. These are actually really nice for $20. But the only thing that would not make me, or would not let me recommend this particular set, if you're going to be wearing these for a long time, or wearing headphones rather for a long time, I suggest you do not buy these. These do not feel very, I mean the ear cups are really good, don't get me wrong. Okay, let me focus here. Ear cups are really good, don't get me wrong. But, this headband is junk. Pretty much. I'm probably going to end up adding my own little bling bling to it later on. By uh, adding some padding up there. Because, uh, yeah. But for $25, what do you really expect? Seriously. Well, I expect a headband. Because even my $10 Century headphones have those. I mean, seriously. Even Century added a nice little pad. I mean... It isn't much of one, but it does do its job. Those will be coming soon for a review. But anyway, these are actually a step up from the centuries at least. But they could have added a darn, uh, they could have added one of those uh, headbands. So uh, for those who will be wearing it a very, very long time, I do not recommend these at all. I'm sorry to say that, and... They do sound good, but I'll likely be returning them anyway, because, uh, because the headband. But, uh, I'm still not sure whether I will, I will be returning this or not. But, uh, yeah. That has been your tour of the JVC HA, uh, great, I forgot the model number. HASR185B. Thank you for watching, and feel free to leave a comment if you have one.